Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from La Liga Smart Bank. It's Tenerife facing Alaves. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff to earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4 4 2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. Here's the Alaves starting lineup. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And so the battle commences. Mohamed Dauda. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Oh, he saved it well. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, no mistake from the keeper, acting decisively. A oh, tremendous vision. And they need to get tighter. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Another great challenge, free kick here. Benavides could be threatening it should be what a block could be troublesome well high and more than a bit hopeful Aitor Sanz. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. Guridi. And they deal with the threat this time. Sanz. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, you would think. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming.
No problems for the keeper. Promising looking ball. Nicely saved. Corner kick played in. And it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be has the strength to hang on to it he has time to play it over well no problems defensively breaking at pace really good high press They've given it away. An incisive pass. Now they've lost it. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Could be a chance to break here. Enrique Gallego. Promising sequence. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. So the whistle then, we're up the halfway stage in this match. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Benavides. Miguel. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? That's a good looking ball. Chance here, and fine goalkeeping. And a substitution in the offing. Delivering it. Determined defending. It's one corner after another.
no one latched onto it. Can they put it away? And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Now sending it in. Well, not the best clearance. This might be ideal for the counter. Neat move. Sanz. Now can they make something happen? Really vital interception here. And the cross goes in. Simple catch, really. Good-looking sequence. And will it be the leveller? And able to get a body in the way. Benavides racing forward trying to catch them out can he finish this well what an opportunity but really good defending you've got to say superb block on the back of the and a goal they've increased their lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. We're inside the final 15 minutes. Really well played pass. Couldn't keep the ball. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Interception to snuff out the danger. Shashua. It's with Envy Gallego. Cross could be useful. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Robert. Guridi. Plenty of support here. Just the clearance that was needed. Shashua. And an astute piece of defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, they profit from this situation. But they took care of the situation defensively. Aitor Sanz. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?